from So I asked the police, I said, well, if they don't give me my money back, because I am going to call headquarters, what do you think? Well, I do not. What do I do next? Oh, well, here goes my card, call us, and we'll come back up here, and, and we know some people, and we'll make sure you'll get your money. I said, okay, bet. I need a fork for this. So I'm sitting here at Taco Bell, and uh, this is what I initially ordered, right? And so I asked the man in there, I say, can I get, he asked me how many sauces I wanted, I said six. He said, I'm only, a, I'm only going to give you what supposedly he felt like I should be get. And I said, what does that mean? Well, I'm going to give you whatever I choose to give you, basically. So he says he's only going to give me four. And I said, okay, well, you know what? I said, well, I ordered two items and a drink. So, I mean, I asked for six. Oh, well, usually we only supposed to give out one I one sauce per item. And I was like, well, when is this? And I was like, you know, I was like, okay, you know what? Let You can just refund my money. And so he sits there and says, He got an attitude, basically, because I asked for a refund. So then I say, okay, where's the proof of the receipt that you refunded my money back? And he says to me, oh, I don't have to show you that for security reasons. And then so I call the police on him. He comes back. Coming, hold on. So I'm from him. Uh, what he gave you is pretty much all he can because he does not have access to their transaction records as he's not a part of security member. Uh, but he has from us that he did, in fact, refund you on your card. Uh, so what he do with the other part of the receipt? You see what I'm saying? Like, this this is not... As I, was, I told him, it was ripped up, but he said he can't reprint it because he has to have a security access to it. His IT department would take a couple of days. Uh, we can't confirm that you are refunded. Uh, just say... I mean, he he normally doesn't work here. I guess he's short on staff or whatever it is. Yeah, but like most places. you know, I mean, this is crazy. So, <laughs> well, he has confirmed that you will get your refund, so it will be pending on your card when you come back. Uh, I would say report to Yeah, and I'm, I mean, I'm reporting to Taco Bell anyways, because I don't... Yeah, file, that, file, file. Yeah, yeah, 
Yeah, yeah, I mean, I will, but that, that just doesn't make no sense. Like, I've never seen somebody be over a refund and then you rip the receipt after I come back through the line because I said I was calling police and he was like, oh, well, good luck, good luck with that. You're hostile or you're going to get arrested. I'm like, for what, sir? I haven't even no, got out my car. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm not worried about that. I'm 43 years old. So I'm not, you know, I just try to handle it the right way because I just felt some type of way about that life. So we, we can get you out of here. We can move on from this. Just, I got to get your uh, information. Okay. Before, uh, yeah. There Correct you. address on the back. And so he showed y'all something? No, you say you didn't have access to it. <laughs> he said that he, he found it in, in looking at the receipt you gave us the mental. It's like all the negatives on it. That's what the, that's what the, yeah, it was what all that they had. I'm just gonna call my card and let them know that, you know. The transaction this time not go through. Yeah. Usually they can freeze the yep. transaction and she goes back. Yeah. Alright, All right, thank you. Yep. Yep. Yeah, yeah. You too. Yeah, I know I don't like forks. But I got a sp oh, I got a spoon in her. I know I had a fork on her, but I got a spoon in her. So I said, okay. So I called headquarters. Headquarters played like they were going to do something. Oh, yeah, we're going to check this out, bye, 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 and they're going to call you. Nobody called. We, two days went by, three days went by. Okay, okay, let me call the police. But hey, this motherfucker took my money, like I told you guys. He ain't refund shit back, ain't shit back on my card yet. I know you got a weed. They say, give a couple more days. Okay, okay. Couple more days, still no refund on my card, right? You didn't give me no food. You didn't give me no cash back. I paid with debit card. The little funky ass half-torn receipt that you gave me. But I forgot to mention that to you guys. My God, it's right. Still have it. It only showed the bottom part and it showed cash. And I'm like, why do they keep showing cash when I, uh, I um, paid with debit? Like, you know, to me, it seemed like he cashed it back out and put the money in his pocket, right? I said, okay. Police tell me to send them all the information about my debit card. I sent them that. And send them a copy of the receipt that I showed them when they pulled up the first day. I showed, I sent that. Now, mind you, it was like in uh, December, somewhere in there. I still haven't heard back from them because they really didn't give a fuck like I told them. Y'all think it's petty, but bitch, this ain't petty to me. That's my money. And not only is it my money, but I didn't eat that day. You know what I say? Like, not for real, for real, but hey, you know what I say? I pay my money. I want my food. Or you going to give me my money back, right? One of the two. Every dime is counted for with me. So, all of a sudden, I call headquarters back. Oh, they talking about. Oh, the first lady I, I talked to, she didn't write it up right. And don't worry, somebody going to call you. I said, okay. A couple days went past, nobody called. 
three, four, five days. Well, as a matter of fact, I let her probably a week went past. Nobody called. I called back. I said, hey, what's going on? You know, I called to report this person, your, your manager, and he's a manager now. And I didn't get my money back. So then they're going to say, oh, we sent it back to the store, and it got closed twice. And there's nothing we can do, so you're not getting your money back. I said, what? <laughs> And I got that recorded, right? Oh, hopefully, I hopefully I upload this when I get home, so I can add in all these receipts I'm telling you guys about. Cause I ain't got to lie about nothing. You know what I say? So I'm like, I didn't went off on the lady. Like, what is you talking about? Like, huh? So you guys just going to take my money and going to get my money back? She's like, yeah, that's right. You're not getting your money back. What? I'm like, I'm like, oh, wow. So Taco Bell, you're a billion dollar corporation and you're taking money from people that's out here working hard to get it. And you don't know if that was my last meal for the day or not or first meal for the day or not or the only meal for the month, right? So I'm like, okay, there's the type of folk shit we're dealing with. So that made me more cautious about when I go to places like Taco Bell and McDonald's and such and such, you know what I say when I'm trying to get me some quick bite to eat because I really like to cook at home, right? I'm only paying with cash because if you fuck up my shit or I don't want my shit, you're going to run me my money back right then and there. We ain't going to be a time. We got time for that fuck shit. You know what I said? We ain't got no time for that fuck shit. You're fucking with people money and we're coming out of pandemic and shit. <laughs> we ain't got no time for that shit, you know? So I'm like, okay. I got y'all. You know, I even got the motherfucker on, on video, the manager at that Taco Bell, telling me he refunded my money and it's going to be processed. Now, this is the second time the police came out. It's six months later. I still ain't got my money. Where's my refund at, sir? Where's my refund? It should be processed. No, it didn't process. I've called my card service. I've called Taco Bell. You're going to have to call Taco Bell. I've already called the headquarters. I have the police coming back up here because you told them, and I have them on video saying that you refunded my money. You didn't refund my money. Yes, I did. No, you didn't, sir. Right. Well, you can go ahead and park them away. It's six months later. I still ain't got my money. No, I had the police got back with me. So what does that tell you, right? They don't give no fucks. But had it been a different race, and I ain't racist because I got all types of races mixed in me and all types of races in my family and all types of shit going on, right? But that just tells you, though, something. Because had it been a different race, oh, they would have fought to got their money back. They would have made sure. Or had we went in in there... And stole some shit up off of the counter or something like that. You know what I say? Oh, they want us to pay, right? Okay. Okay, okay. Now, at this point, six months later, yeah, the money is, you, you chop that up as a loss. But guess what? I ain't done with filing my complaints on their asses. You're best to believe that one. When I got all my evidence, because I just want to prove a point. How are you going to let your manager take people money like that? And then you tell us, ain't nothing you can do for us. But let me been working for a Taco Bell or something, and I took some money, or you'll be pressing charges against me, because I took money. 
as in because of my skin color or what you know what i said like i don't understand i'm like i, I was very respectful to this man for his order and so why are you taking my money from me like if you're mad because you ain't got no workers in there working with you that's your problem if you're mad they sent you into an area where you really don't like black people that's your problem go find another fucking job bitch so i was highly upset with that shit you know what i see i said okay okay we ain't gonna be we ain't gonna be we ain't gonna be fucking with they asses too much you know and the only thing the cops could say was well, i suggest you not to come back to this one you know but we're gonna figure out something yeah you little fucker liars you suggested that because you know you don't want a motherfucker to act a fool. See, that's what he was trying to do, provoke me to act a fool. But I'm way smarter than that, bitch. I'm a grown-ass woman. I know one thing. Had I act a fool, your ass would have been trying to call the police on me. But instead, I called the police on your ass just to show you, bitch, I ain't afraid of no motherfucking police. If you caught them on me or not, bitch, I'm going to sit right there and wait. You know what I say? Like, what fuck going on here and shit? Nobody got time for that. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. And don't play with my money. There's a moral of the story, right? Don't play with my money. Got me another freezy today this time. They had, well, I went to another store and they had styrofoam cups. But I got, I got my favorite mix-up, cherry pina colada and not too much cherry because i i'm a if i have too much red dye uh causing me to have a migraine red dye garlic too much sunlight you don't know too much caffeine so all these are caffeine free really Yeah, I was heated like a motherfucker, you know. I was heated like a motherfucker that day. I said, oh, wow. I said, this motherfucker just stole my money. Shame on you. Shame on you, Taco Bell. For having people working there like that, you know. But the crazy part about it was... When I asked him for the headquarters number, right? The little fuck-ass manager... He going to tell me. And when I told him I'm going to report him, he told me good luck with that. I'm saying to myself, like, good luck with that? What, you, what the hell talking about good luck with that? You know what I say? Like, what you mean good luck with that? But now I see why he say good luck with that because they don't give a fuck about that. You know what I say? Last for up, Taco Bell. Last for up, Taco Bell. I fucked up. How dare you take from consumers like that? And then you act like you don't give no fuck when they when 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 we call up to the higher up, which is headquarters. You don't get no fuck. So why should we give a fuck about giving you our money and shit, you know? I'm not saying all Taco Bells, right? Because I've had great experience with some a lot of different Taco Bells. I don't eat there often, you know what I say? So, but that particular Taco Bell, oh yeah, fuck they asses. Fuck they asses with a silver spoon. <laughs> Yeah, no. But yeah, that's my little that's my little moot bang story about Taco Bell while I was sitting there eating because I'm in another city about about an hour away from my house, so I'm gonna drink some of this water. 
that steak thing. It was pretty good, you know. Didn't really have a lot of steak on it, which is good because I really don't like a lot of meat. You know. So, that was all I needed for the day. For the meantime, meantime. But a meantime being time, right? So I am going to go take me a little walk today in a minute, so. Which won't be a part of this vlog because I'm going to have to flip it the other way. So we're going to do something, but. Yeah, that, that was my, my mukbang story for Taco Bell ass. But speaking of that, yeah, that was pretty good. I can't, I can't complain with the the little steak thing. You know, I might have it again. Okay, we're back. I was all in my mouth. I ain't want y'all to be seeing me all. Try to make sure I got no food sick and nowhere. What was that? But anyways, I'm on my, my, my cherry cola. The cherry cola breeze today. First time trying it, and it is pretty good. I can't lie. I told the girl at the store, like, if I have this shit ain't good, I'm bringing this shit back to you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and she like, you know you can. I'm like, yeah, because shit, I be trying all kind of flavors. I don't really like the mint shit too much. But I'm a fruity person, so I said, well, let me, let me, let me go outside the box today. We're going to try that cherry cola and shit, you know. Which was pretty good, let me see. How many minutes in? Okay. Well, I'm going to end this one. And I'll be back when we go take a walk. Peace.